is training to join the police force, but a cadet is already being recognized for his bravery after a dramatic rescue on the water. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaquette in Port Huron tonight with how that rescue played out in the St. Clair River. The term humble hero really applies here. That police cadet says he knew exactly what to do when he saw two young girls go under here in the water. 19 year old Joseph Holzberger might be young, but he's already proving he's got what it takes to save a life. Just last night at the foot of Griswold Street, where many children play, he was on a fireworks patrol and noticed two girls ages 9 and 13 in trouble. I heard uh, a woman scream for help um, by the water that was right there. They were going underwater and they were resurfacing back and forth. Um, one of the girls noticed me and she kind of did a little wave to me and screamed for help and then she went back under. Joseph has never been a lifeguard, but that didn't stop him from pulling the girls out safely and returning them to shore. I told Cadet Shouty to radio for help and I told uh, Cadet Bishop to uh, kind of wash the shoreline for me and make sure uh, the girls were in my line of sight. They pushed me down underwater at first and then I was, I was prepared for it and I resurfaced and kind of like grabbed their arms to kind of get them to stop resisting a little bit and then um, pull them in closer. The girls had been swept away from the sandbar and were still out of sorts, but later were checked out and found to be okay. Their parents arrived later and police did alert Child Protective Services. It's making me feel happy. I was glad I was down there at that right time, right moment. Um, just, you never know. That cadet says he is very proud of what he did. In fact, it's the very reason he's joining the police department. From Port Huron, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. All right, good for him. Thank you, Simon.